Oh, I'm in love. The only thing more perfect is a purple one. Hey there, worldwide webbing peeps, and welcome to my Let's Play Ark series. Today I am on the Crystal Isles map on the Panamonium's World Eternal Patron server. How y'all doing today? You doing all right? Yeah? That's good. That's good to know that you're doing all right. I have a lot of real life stuff going on, so apologies in advance if the videos are hit and miss in the next, I don't know, foreseeable future. But I shall do my best to keep entertaining you as best I can. So, what is going on today? Well, as I said, I've got real life stuff going on, so I'm not, I'm not up to date. I pre-recorded quite a few videos, um, which came in handy that I could just plop up on the internet to keep your people entertained, hopefully. Mm. Uh, but now I'm all caught up. And there are otters. Come here. There are otters. I mean, they're so cute, are they not? I mean, what would make them more perfect than the cuteness that they are now would be purple. Purple, but I hear that if you breed them and interbreed them and all that business that you can actually get purple ones So the search for otter begins uh, Before I set off I would just like to draw attention to the problems of the YouTube Creators yes, not just me in fact not me at all because I don't earn anything with these videos I just love doing them um, but yeah, there are some people out there that like to earn a living doing YouTube videos and for their sakes, I would just like to say, if you like someone's video, hit the thumbs up button. It makes a huge difference, especially to those that are earning money. It makes a huge difference. To me, it just makes me happy. <laughs> I love it. I love it. But to those that are trying to earn a living, if you like their videos, please take that second. It only takes a second to hit that thumbs up button and make their world a brighter place. Yes. Okay. So, lecture over. Right. Um... I don't really know where to look for these otters. I'm guessing near water. So uh, in and around the White Shoals is maybe a good idea to look. And I hear that there's something a little bit like the Hesperonis, where you have to kill a fish, drag it towards them, shove it in their mouths. Bob's your uncle tamed. Hmm. So I might actually go and look on the floating island. Huh. If game. Pause. Lag. Hmm. I might go and look on the... F <laughs> Opening islands, but I'm just gonna have a quick look around the White Shoals area first. And when I find one, I shall bring you back. Okay, I'm very nervous about checking out this particular water, but I've just seen some Hesper Renininesses. So hopefully, let's put you on passive. No, no, that's not it at all. No, back. Hmm, eh, there. Oh dear. Okay, so let's just have a look in the water. I mean, I don't know if it, if they spawn where Hesperonis do, but... Um, yes! Oh, yes! There is one! What is it? 500, that'll do! Don't care! Uh, bleh, bleh, bleh. fish! Hmm? Drag? Oh, where did it go? I've lost it already! No! Oh, good God! Ah, uh, hmm! There it is! There it is! There it is! And... We just go in with the... Can we... Ready? Can we... Just take a break. I want to give you the fish! Oh, he stopped for me. What, what, what does it say? Feed fish. Right, okay. More fish. Huh? Hmm? Okay, where is it? We see? Is that it? I think so. Me. Keep still. I wish to feed the fish. Okay. Ah. Uh. A bit. A bit. I can't see it. No. It was just here. Was it not? Oh yes, we got one! Ha ha! 
victorious. Uh, well, we'll just call you Otter for now because I... I bleh, hmm, where are you? Where did you go? Oh, there you are. Are you? Where are you? Oh, there. Okay, female. Tamed out at 7.49. Oh. We have a quick look at your stats. Ugh, you know, it's only a little guy. 800... Let's stick that in there. 872 health. 2,000 staminas. Oxygen. Well, obviously, it's a water-based dino, so it's going to have a lot of oxygen. Weight. Ooh, dear. 90. Malise. 677. Movement speed. 170. I didn't notice if it was mate boosted or not because really well we want two of them don't we no oh, oh, right well let's just go and find 768 I was trying to think what its name was but we haven't given it a name have we we need to put this somewhere where we can see how cute it is um can you land on this rock oh unfollow you can we have a look can we can we see I need to look at your cuteness can I add it Come here. No. Oh, good God. I don't want to see how cute you are. I mean, we can see how cute you are. Oh, there is. Oh, oh my God. It is so cute. Come on. I want to sit it. No. Can you look at me? Look at me. Oh. Oh, I'm in love. The only thing more perfect is a purple one, of course. Right. You stay there. Um, let's put you on. Oh. Uh, hmm. Let's put you on neutral. I don't think there's any badness, but is there any more here? Hesperonis. Yes, there is! Oh my good god! Uh, fish! Mm. Fish? Any fish? Damned Hesperonis has eaten them all. Oh no, this one. Please be a male. Have it. Can we? Yes. Where did it go? They're so tiny and hard to see. Can we have a fish, sir? Uh, no, oh, no, turn that back on. We might be able to... Uh, uh, wait. Mm -hmm. Yes, keep still. Feed. Okay, it wants more. It wants more. Ah, uh, fish. Oh, good God. Let's get a big one this time. A bit. Yes, drag. Thank you. There it is. Come on now, nice juicy fish for you. Come we a bit. Where? Oh, and feed, feed. Can we? Oh, we missed. Give to me. Where did it go? Oh. fish! Oh, good God. I shall use you instead. Oh, no, wait. You've got a friend. Ah. Right, there it is. Right, okay. Drag. And up underneath. Stealth mode. Feed. Yes, okay. And wait. More fish. There was another fish. There it is. Grab it. I mean, these are slightly easier than the Hesperonis. Can we... Have it. Oh, nearly, nearly. Okay, uh, more fish. One more fish, please. Fishies. Oh, wait, there, there's one. Where is it? There. And, and, can we? No. Come, oh, oh, we got. Very tricky, you know, very tricky. Feed it. Yes. Oh, my good God, we rock. No, not that at all. It's one of those and otter too. For now. And what are you? Please be... Oh, it's another female. Oh, okay. Well, I'm going to carry on looking for a male because I want to breed these guys. I want mutations and whatnots. Mm, I'll be right back. Oh, just look at this cuteness. How cute are they? I mean, there's one especially cute one there in purple. Oh, no, wait, that's me. Uh, yeah, these are... I'm stuck, I'm stuck. I'm so excited. You guys are the best. 
the best dino ever. I mean, they're not even a dino, are they? But these have got to be the best creation yet. Look at their little teeth and their little claws. There he is. We're going to have some fun with you. So, hmm. Now, these guys only eat fish. So we're going to have to go out and get a load of fish for you, aren't we? Yes. Oh, look, it blinks. <laughs> oh, do something cute. Hmm? Do something cute. Uh, so you're the male. You two are female. Okay, so we need to build a little breeding pen for you, and then you can have woohoos and have a great time and give me babies. Yes? Does it sound good? It sounds good to me. Okay, right. Well, uh, hmm. I'm going to go ahead and build them a breeding pen, and I'll be right back. And we have built the taming pen. If I can just struggle around there. Square box. Always best. With a view. Okay, do you have mids? Well, let's go ahead and put some more in just in case. Now, can we do this and get out before they leg it? Okay, so behavior, enable wandering. Behavior, enable wandering. Behavior, enable wandering. Exit, close, job done. Are they doing it? Hmm. Are you shy? Oh, yes, they're doing it. Look away. Hey, how are you doing, Megatherium? We still haven't given you a name. No. Okay, let's leave these guys to it. I'll bring you back when something happens. Oh, this one is gestating. Oh, this is good. Um, hmm. Well, let's pick you up. Take you next door. D d take you next door into the nursery. Yes, this one also. Very good. Okay, well, keep them separate so we know whose baby is whose to start with. Because I get very confused. Actually, we should give them names, should we not? Let's call you... Otto. You're level f 846, you're level... Okay, so you're the youngest, so to speak. I mean, one of them has to be called. Tarka, of course. I can't remember if Tarka's a boy or a girl, but it's a girl now. We should call you... Olga. There we go. Olga the otter, Tarka the otter, and Otto the otter. So how long have we got? We've got about ten minutes. Okay. Exciting stuff, folks. Exciting stuff. They're so cute. Is it? Is it a thing? Are you there? Yes. Yes, I can see something. Imprint, uh, baby otter, can we uh, do that in a minute, and can we stick some things in there? Uh, okay, what is it? It's a male. Okay. The next door. Can we? Yes. Yes! Was it? Oh, look, a little nose! How cute is that? Can we... And then stick some of that in there for you. Oh, yes, that's much better. So two males. Hmm, could have done with a female. But does it have any... Can we... No, there, somewhere. There, there you are. Does it have any mutations? No, it doesn't. And do you? No mutations there either. Hmm. Okay, well. Now begins the long and laborious job of trying to mutate otters. Oh my god, how cute is that? Oh, do it again. Do it again. Hmm? Would you please? It's so cute. Okay, so we're getting quite a few otters now. This one here is the only one. Can we have a look? See? Yes, thank you. It's the only one so far with a mutation. And I believe 
it is the stripe down its back, which does look a little bit purple, does it not? Hmm? Yes. But what am I going to do with all these otters? I don't know. I mean, I could have taken a shortcut and gone over to Duckman's and used his mutator thingamajig, but I actually wanted to see what I could get just from doing it naturally. But all I'm getting is an overflow of otters, so I decided to build them somewhere to live. So this is going to be my otter pen, which looks absolutely horrendous at the moment, but by the time I've finished, hopefully, it will look, well, a little bit more natural. Oh no, disaster has struck! I can't believe it! Damned parasaurs! What's the... what? Oh, look, that's one of my otters right there! Oh, and it was a mutated one of those stupid, stupid things! Oh, I've still got two left. Can we do this? Oh no. Oh no! I just killed another one! <laughs> this, is, this is terrible! Stop it! I don't like it! This breeding of things and whatnot. Well, I've got one left. Have I got one? Or is it two? Who are you? Oh, I don't know! It's a disaster! An absolute disaster, folks! Oh, I've been doing this uh, breeding malarkey for days. Actually, days. I've been doing it for three real... Can we... Can we... Is it? For three real days. I don't get rid of that corpse because I'll probably end up killing one of these guys. Yeah, so what I discovered... Let's put this away before I do any more damage than I've already done. Oh, dear God. Okay, so, um, yeah. What I discovered is that um, it is better to breed from ones that look the same in order to get a mutation. So these all look the same. This one looks a little bit slightly different, but these look the same. And they have zero mutations. And that, apparently, is the best way to do it. Um, and in here, because like, they've got... These have got like a brown stripe and a white front. And these ones over here, can we get in? Oh, who designed this thing? Ah, oh, don't look. Um, okay, so these ones have got a black stripe down the back and a cream front. And from these combinations of keeping them together, you know, in their, in their color coordinated things, we ended up getting, well, these ones. Yeah, with the purple stripe seemed to come from these ones mostly. And I did have four of them. Mm, but now we just have the one who looks slightly injured there. Okay, and in here we have some better ones. Can we just pick you up away from that dead body? Somewhere? There? Mm, yes? Okay, and plop you down here? Okay, so we have the green back one. Who is your parent? Olga. Again, that is the black striped one over there that produced this one. Then we have this one here, which is a redhead, I believe, came from Tarka. Tarka, which is the brown stripe on the back. And then if we could just go around here so you can get a better look. We got this one here, which I think is pretty cool, that yellow. So we've got things to work with, but you know what? Come here. I, otters! I've actually had enough of otters because I've been doing it for three days and without much success, really. I mean, okay, so we've got four now with mutations and we have our breeding bears and whatnots and oh dear, they're babies. Um, yeah. Anyway, I went ahead and I built a little pen for them all for when I finished breeding them. I think it's turned out all right. What do you think? Hmm? I mean, these guys are loving a little swim. There's only males in there because I don't want any dead babies floating around in my pool and whatnot. And we can always sit down here and watch them swimming around. I think it's pretty cool, don't you? Hmm. I've created a little seating area so that we can see them from every angle. So we could sit here and walk that way. And I love these shrooms. Look at these shrooms. And we could sit here and watch them from this angle. Marvellous. I impress myself sometimes, you know. I do indeed. But I said I wanted a purple otter. Ooh. That is a very interesting ragdoll that I need to get rid of because I don't like it. It's ugly. But I might kill this one in the process. <laughs> I'm so 
So sorry I killed your brothers and sisters. But you have potential. Yes. If I could just get one with a purple, purple body, yeah, we could probably, you know, cross-match them or something. I don't know. I don't really get it. I am very tempted to go over to Duckman's and use his mutator thingy and see if I can get quicker results that way. So no purple otter for me today. Not in this episode. No, I think it's going to take a very, very long time. But I am not going to give up. I am not going to take a shortcut. I will not use a mutator. I will just keep reading these guys until I get what I want. Yes, a purple otter. Mm -hmm. But you know what, folks? Just look at the time. It must be tear clock. Certainly is in this house after all this breeding and then killings and cullings and... Oh, accidents will happen, folks. But before you go... If you like this video, or you just want to make an old lady happy, then please go ahead and hit that thumbs up button because it means the world to me, it really does. And if you're new, or you just clicked on me by accident, oh, hello, how you doing? Why not subscribe and we can go on this journey of awful videos together, folks. I mean, what more could you want? Hmm? Hmm? I don't know either. But until the next time, goodbye now.